Good morning everyone. It is just after four o'clock and I am on my way to KZN, KwaZulu Natal. Now for those who don't know South Africa, uh, KZN is on the eastern side of South Africa and the coast over there is divided into two parts. You get the north coast and the south coast. Now in my case, I'm going to the north coast. I've been driving for about two hours and uh, the sun has just showed its face and I think it is time for breakfast. I'm just a short way from Moy River and that is where I'm going to have breakfast. I've just had my breakfast and uh, I feel a lot better now. They have some animals up the hill there, so I'm quickly gonna have a look at them. There's a whole lot of shops here that a person can stop and spend lots and lots of money. Uh, I'm not going to do that, I'm going to just drive straight past and continue on my way. Now I'm looking for a turn off to the right. I'm in the fast lane. Um, there's a place called the Little Church. And there's a tea garden as well and that is where I'm going to stop now but I have to find this slipway I think this is gonna be a fast one hold on this is gonna be a quick turn another dead filling station you know I've seen a couple of these filling stations on the road and it's so sad to see these things die. Oh, here's the church.
I wanted to call this a graveyard, but that's a bit crude. I think this, let's call it a wall of remembrance. This is behind the little church. the tea garden and little shop. Yes, and then I have to be on my way again. This is going to be a difficult crossing because people are traveling at high speed and I have to fall into the traffic. Let's see. Well, that wasn't too bad. Off we go. Oh, I forgot to, to mention this is at Van Rienen. If you can recall on my one of my previous videos, which I will link on the screen, uh, I have, instead of turning right to the little church, I have turned left and went down the mountain on an alternative route. Instead of sticking to the highway, I think I'm going to drive next to the coast. Oh dear, this seems or looks like it's been a mistake. Now I'm stuck in traffic and it's moving very slowly. At last, my destination 
is just around the corner. Let me find some parking over here. I'm a bit early, so I'll have to do the long wait. I'm about two hours too early, so I will have to yeah, do the long wait. Right, we've just re received a phone call to say that the key is ready and uh, we've grabbed that and uh, we can eventually go to our apartment or flat or place to stay, whatever you want to call it. very kind very friendly porters to help me carry my stuff up Now this is my view from my balcony, there's my braai and let's go and have a look what is inside here. Well this is the lounge, a dinner table which I will probably never use because I'll eat outside. Fridge that sounds like a tractor and uh, of course a stove and there's a microwave that you can't see but it's a fully equipped kitchen and then we go to the one bedroom it's a three bedroom this and then a bathroom over here and there I missed almost missed the first throne and then there's a second uh, bedroom and then of course the main bedroom always you know these oaks spend so much time making the place look nice very cool and then it's the main bedroom's bathroom and of course a throne over there with a reasonably sized shower and then of course the shower head is the thing that i'm really interested in because you know, the shower makes your stay. Good shower, good stay. Bad shower, bad stay. Now I will put this shower head to the test. It looks very fancy. 
but uh, it must do the job. Anyway. I was expecting air conditioning, but the fans, volume control. Never ends all around, all around. I've switched it now too loud. The fan is experiencing a little bit of wobbling there. Hopefully it will stay put. Now, I always end the day in a traditional way, and that is with a braai. Uh, those ships that you see there, I actually counted 29 of these ships and they are all waiting to go into the Durban Harbour to offload their goods. Um, we'll see how long it takes them to get in there. Anyway, let me carry on with my braai. Thank you for watching. Until next time, goodbye.